think is going to get the victory. I think Greg the Hammer Valentine is going to get the win. So we have a pick em coming in right now. Let's send it down to ringside and get your introductions. These two have had a very this good feud for several weeks now. And Greg the Hammer Valentine, there he is right there, looking to secure the gold here tonight at Elimination Chamber. These two are fairly evenly matched, and the feud has been very entertaining so far. We'll see Ladies how things go tonight. Reminder, the championship is on the line here tonight. And in looking at the opposition, I can say that the champion will have quite the hill to climb in this one. This is a man who makes the most of every opportunity, and this is his biggest opportunity ever. Yes, Godspeed, he did. I just had to look it up because I didn't remember. He won it one time in 19, 1984 in London, Ontario. He beat Tito. I had to look it up. I didn't remember for certain. And then I believe Tito won it back in Baltimore in a steel cage match, if I remember correctly. There's your Intercontinental Champion for now. The champ comes into his title defense incredibly competent, Corey. And with good reason, Cole. When you're the champ, you don't have to worry about winning. You just have to make sure you don't lose. That is the champion's advantage. That is correct. That is absolutely correct. Many have written him off as champion, but he is determined to prove his doubters wrong. This has been a very good match between these two, uh, feud between these two so far. Tonight's match should be no different. Don't go anywhere after this one. We got the Elimination Chamber match coming up next for the WWF Heavyweight Championship. Introducing the challenger from Seattle, Washington, weighing in at 253 pounds, Greg the Hammer Valentine. And introducing the champion from El Paso, Texas, weighing in at 247 pounds, he is the World Wrestling Alliance. Intercontinental Champion, Tito Santana. Tito Santana, your Intercontinental Champion, coming you into this match. Guys, and like I said, don't forget, champion. coming up after this, we have the Elimination Chamber match, the main event of the evening for the WWF Heavyweight Championship. King Kong Bundy will go into that match as champion. We'll see who comes out with the gold. Right here, we got Greg the Hammer Valentine challenging Tito Santana for the Intercontinental Championship. These two have been in a feud for several weeks. It's been a very entertaining feud. Tonight, the gold is on the line, and Greg the Hammer comes out. All business getting off to a pretty good start. And he's going to take a rest here, kind of floating up on that top turnbuckle. Tito comes back with a solid right hand to the head. Oh, helicopter spin. This is ridiculous. This is I agree. Insulting. That's stupid. But a little bitch slap to the back of the head. A little humiliation there from the champion. The hammer's not going to appreciate that. Tito Santana now with a running snapmare. Rolling snapmare, I'm sorry. Heel hook by Santana. All the pressure on the ankle and the knee. That's a move... Greg usually uses as he's warming up those legs, loosening him up anyway for the figure four. As he's doing right now, hard knee into the knee of Tito Santana. Cranium buster by the hammer. Back of Tito's head slamming hard into the canvas. 
Oh, he was going for a big blow. Tito got a back elbow up to slow the hammer down. Santana with a nice suplex. He's going to go for the pinfall. It's a two count. Hammer kicked out at two. Tito's feeling pretty good about himself, but he really shouldn't be. Greg's had the uh, advantage most of the match here. We're still early, though. Tito's submission hold. Trying to separate that shoulder right in the middle of the ring. Hammer's got to find a way out. Up and over. And a couple of right hands. And Greg the Hammer breaks the hole, boot to the midsection, he brings Tito in, he's got him high above, walking him over to the ropes, what's he gonna do, he slams Tito Santana over the top rope, out onto the floor, Valentine's up on the top rope, what's he gonna do, waiting for Tito to get to his feet, big chop, missed, Tito Santana saw it coming and sidestepped him, both men out on the floor right now, Arm ringer takedown into a Fujiwara arm bar by Tito Santana. All that pressure on the elbow and the shoulder. Tito's going to try and rip that arm right off now. There it is. Look at Tito Santana. Valentine, not only the pressure on the knee, but the pressure on the neck as well. And right now, Tito having his way with Valentine. Nice reversal by Valentine, just as I said that. He gets a powerful clothesline in there, and Tito hit the floor hard. Both men back in the ring now. Intercontinental Championship on the line here tonight. Is Valentine going to go for a pin here? No. Tito with the elbow to the midsection. Nice reversal. Suplex for Santana. That had plenty of power behind it. Tito goes for the cover. The leg is hooked. Trying to retain his title. Two count. Valentine kicks out. Tito thought he had him there. He thought it was over. Oh, he walked right into a DDT. Nicely done by the hammer. Knee to the small of the back by Greg Valentine. Santana rolled out of the way of more damage, but Tito's still in control. Dropping Tito's throat on the top rope. That hurts. The hammer to the back of the head. And Tito's face crashes hard into the mat. Valentine going for the title now. Leg is hooked. Two count. Santana kicked out. Valentine thought he had him after that hammer. He may have to put that figure four on. Is he going to go for it now? He is. Greg Valentine with the figure four. He's got it locked in. Tito can reach the ropes if he tries. He may not know where he is. Look at the pain he's in. Valentine's got it cinched in. He's got it cinched in hard. And Tito trying to reach over there. And he did. He got a right hand across the jaw. And Valentine had to release the hold. But he had it on for a long time. Tito's knees are not in good shape right now. He's got Greg. Belly to belly suplex by Tito Santana. He's going to climb up to the top rope now. Valentine's still down. Tito diving leg drop off the top rope. That could be a finisher. He's got the leg hooked. Valentine's shoulders are down. And not anymore. He got up just in time. Valentine's still alive. Here comes Tito. He's got the sharpshooter locked in. He doesn't have it cinched in as much as he could, but it's still a very uncomfortable position. Valentine's in a lot of pain. If Tito cinches it down a little more, he can get the hammer to tap out, but he let it go instead. And there's another hammer. Big elbow to the head. Tito walked right into it. He may be out. One count. What a gutsy performance. Valentine went for the knife edge chop. Tito rolled out of the way nicely. And he's got Valentine down again. Stepping through. Tito Santana. Surfboard. Face plant. Valentine's face hard into the canvas. Tito goes to retain the title. And he got him. He rode that surfboard face plant 
two and three count, and Tito Santana is still your Intercontinental Champion. Here is your winner, and still World Wrestling Alliance Intercontinental Champion, Tito Santana. Tito Santana successfully defends the Intercontinental Championship. Good match against Greg Valentine. It was got to be three and a half stars is your official match rating. So far, all of the championships have been successfully defended here tonight.